Billy, today's Michael's birthday. Do you know what he wants for a present? Um, yeah, I actually know exactly what he wants, Mom. He just told me the other day. Come on, let's go to Target. Okay, I'll go get the keys and meet you in the car. You're such a good little brother. Yes, today's my birthday. I hope Mom gets me a good present. We're home from this store. Let's sing happy birthday and eat cake so you can open your present up. No way, that box is shaped just like a PS5. I bet you Mom got me a PlayStation. You're right, that does look like a PS5 box. Dude, if you get a PlayStation, I'm playing with you. Happy birthday to you. Okay, time to open presents. Here you go, Michael. Billy told me exactly what you wanted, and he even helped me pick it out for you. I hope you like it. <laughs> it's a really good gift, Michael. Mom, hurry up and cut me a piece of cake. Oh, man, I don't believe it. It's definitely a PS5. I was just telling Billy the other day how bad I wanted one. What the heck? A cocomelon toy? What's the matter, Michael? Do you not like it? No, I don't like it. I don't watch Cocomelon, Mom. That show's for babies. Oops. Sorry, Mom. I guess that's what I really wanted. I must have got confused. Since Michael doesn't like it, can I have it, please? Sure thing, Billy, sweetie. Since Michael doesn't like his gift we got him, you can have it. Yes, my plan worked perfectly. <laughs> Hurry up and give me my toy, Michael. Are you kidding me? So am I not getting a birthday present, Mom? Whatever, fine. Here you go, Billy. That's bullshit. Hey, everybody, Grandma's here. Where's the birthday boy at? Ah, oh, there you are. Hi, Michael. Happy birthday. Yes, Grandma's here. Hi, Grandma. Thanks. Guess what? Billy told Mom I wanted a cocomelon toy for my birthday, and when I told Mom I didn't want it, she gave it to Billy, so now I don't have a present. Are you kidding me? Ouch, I'm sorry. And here's one for you, Billy. Ouch, Grandma! Now, I want you to return that toy right now and give Michael the cash for it. And Michael, I got your present outside. Come take a look. No way, really? What is it? No way, are you serious? You got me a quad, Grandma? Thank you so much. You're the best. Aw, oh, you're welcome, sweetie. No problem. And I also ordered you a PS5. It should be here any day now. Oh, yeah. And we're almost at a million subscribers on YouTube. So for every new subscriber that we get... I'm going to throw a sandal at Billy's head! Uh-oh! Ah! Hey, has anybody seen my- <gasps> Riley, what are you doing?! Those are my toys! I never said you can play with them! They're collectibles! Give them back to me, right now! You're not allowed to touch my toys! I don't care if you're sad! You can give me the pal pal face all you want! But these are mine! Really, Billy? Taking toys from a baby? Now that's low. You don't even play with them anymore. Yes, I do. I play with them all the time. You just never see me playing with them. And if she wants toys, she can go to the store and get her own toys. That's like stealing candy from a baby, Billy. Just let her play with them. No! No means no! <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought! Get out of here! I don't even feel like playing with these anymore. Did you really take the toys away from her and you don't even want to play with them? Come on, Billy. Yeah, so what? They're my toys. I can do whatever I want with them. Plus, I got bored. I'm going to go play on my iPad. <laughs> Guys, my iPad's dead. Did you see the charger? <gasps> Riley, I said you're not allowed to touch my toys! And what did you do to JJ? You destroyed him! Give me that! I can't believe it! You wrote all over JJ's face and you destroyed my toy! Hey, what's going on in here? What's all the commotion about? Good thing you're here, Mom! Riley wrote all over my toy and she ruined it! <laughs> oh, Riley, did you draw all over JJ's face? Oh, my little makeup artist! She just wanted to give JJ a makeover, Billy. JJ didn't need a makeover, Mom, and she ruined my toy. Now I need you to take me to the store and get a new one. No, I'm not taking you to the store to get a new toy, Billy. Just go try to scrub it off. I'm sure it'll come off. No, it won't. It's permanent marker. 
It'll be fine, Billy. And Riley, I didn't know you liked Cocomelon so much. Since Billy doesn't want to share his toys with you, let's go to the store. I'll buy you a new Cocomelon toy. What? Are you serious? You're going to take her to the store to get a new toy? Take me to the store and get me a new toy. Here, Riley can have this one. No, Riley doesn't want that old doll. It's got a marker all over its face. Riley wants a new toy. Come on, Riley. Let's go to the store. Yeah, the marker's from her, Mom. Are you kidding me? We're back from the store. Look at Riley's new toy she got. <laughs> That's the toy I wanted. This is baloney. <laughs> Billy, what are you doing? I'm not Billy. You already know who I am. My name's Topher and, um... <laughs> God, dude, I think you've been watching too much TikTok. Are you serious? How are you not laughing right now? That's literally the funniest thing ever. My name's Topher and, uh... Billy, it's only funny when Topher says it. When you say it, it's just stupid. Yes, it is funny when I do it. And why do you guys keep calling me Billy? I already told you. My name's Topher and, uh... <laughs> Billy, you're making Topher look bad. Just stop. You guys just don't understand comedy. Because that's literally the funniest thing ever. Trust me, we know comedy. Watch, I bet I can make Michael laugh. Yeah, right. I'm way funnier than you. There's no way you can make Michael laugh. Okay, challenge accepted. Oh! <laughs> now that's comedy. Boys, what's going on in here? What's all the commotion about? Mom, I came in here to tell them a joke, and they didn't think it was funny. And that's when Tommy threw his shoe at me. And I keep trying to tell him to stop calling me Billy, because clearly, my name's Topher and, um, <laughs> Tommy, I can't believe he threw a shoe at your brother. You're grounded. And if he wants to be called Topher, you boys call him Topher. Oh, man, are you serious, Mom? And no, I'm not calling him Topher. Mom, trust me. I call Billy a lot of names, but I'm definitely not calling him Topher. I can't disgrace Topher's name like that. Topher's actually cool, and Billy is just, well, Billy. Listen, you boys are going to call your brother Topher, and that's final. I don't want to hear another word about this. <laughs> you guys heard, Mom. You better start calling me Topher from now on. Oh, man, I wonder if Mom will legally change my name to Topher. That will be so cool. Then I could all be like, my name's Topher, and, um, <laughs> This can't be real life. <coughs> What, are you trying to get the whole family sick? Cover your mouth. Okay, I'm sorry. It came out of nowhere. I can't believe I'm so sick. And we have our school field trip tomorrow. I'm going to miss it. I'm sure your class is going to be very happy about that. No, they're not. Don't say that. I'm literally the coolest kid in the class. So what are you, the only kid in the class, Billy? No, there's a bunch of us. Oh, man, I have to figure out how to get better. I don't want to miss going to the aquarium. <laughs> Why don't you just use Grandma's Secret Home Remedies to get better, Billy? Michael, what are you doing? Don't tell Billy about Grandma's Secret Remedies. It's a secret for a reason. Yeah, you're right. I shouldn't tell him. Grandma will probably get upset. Are you guys serious? Grandma has a secret remedy to make me feel better? Does it really work? Yeah, it works. One time I had a baseball game, but I was so sick I couldn't go. And then Grandma told me one of her secrets, and I was better in 10 minutes. I remember that game. You ended up winning, didn't you? One time, Grandma's Home Remedies made me better in 5 minutes. No way! Come on, guys! You gotta tell me Grandma's secret! I'll do anything! I'll do your chores for the next month, and I'll even give you $100! Okay, fine, Billy. We'll tell you. Go get a bottle of mustard. Huh? Why do we need a bottle of mustard? Do you want to know Grandma's secret remedies or not, Billy? Don't question us. Just go get a bottle of mustard. Okay, okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, I'm back, and I got the mustard. What now? Okay, so first you got to dump the mustard on your hand, and then rub it all over your armpits. I'm not rubbing mustard all over my armpits. Fine. Don't do it then, Billy. I guess you don't want to go on your field trip. Yes, I do want to go on my field trip. It's to the aquarium, and the aquarium's my favorite. Fine, I'll rub the mustard all over my armpits. Oh, it's so cold. Are you sure this is going to work? <laughs> yeah, it's going to work, Billy. You're going to be feeling better in no time. Next, you got to rub an onion all over your body. <laughs> oh, man, it's making my eyes water. Well, at least no vampires will come near me now. <laughs>
Next, you gotta get whipped cream and put it all over your face. Okay, I guess. Come on, Billy. You can do it. It's for your field trip. Okay, and for the last part, you gotta sit on three raw eggs until they're warm and cluck like a chicken. Man, how did Grandma ever figure this out? Cluck, cluck, cluck. Guys, I don't think it's working. I don't feel any better. <laughs> Look, it's Chicken Little. <laughs> I can't believe you believed us, Billy. There's no such thing as Grandma's secret remedies. <laughs> you guys are the worst brothers ever! Mom! Boys, did you tell your brother that Grandma has a secret remedy to make him feel better? You're both grounded! Get up to your room! <laughs> totally worth it! Hey guys, I got a question. Did you ever notice that Dad is never home? Yeah, that's so weird that you just said that, Billy. Me and Michael were just talking about it. And I think we figured out why. Tommy, what are you doing? Don't tell Billy. He's gonna freak out. Wait, what? Why would I freak out? What's going on? Come on, guys, tell me. I promise I won't freak out. Michael, I think we should tell him. Fine, if you say so. All right, Billy, so you know how Dad's always gone, and as soon as he comes home, he sits down on the couch and he falls asleep? Yeah, so he's just tired from work. That's what Dad wants you to think, Billy, but he's not going to work every day. If he's not going to work, then where is he going? One time, me and Tommy followed him, and instead of going to work, he went into the middle of the woods, and he got picked up by a UFO. Are you guys serious right now? Yeah, I got a picture of it on my phone. We don't think Dad's our dad. We think he's an alien that took over Dad's body. Here, look. Holy flipping Cocomelons! He really is an alien! What are we gonna do? See, I told you not to tell him he's gonna freak out. It's okay, he'll be fine. Just breathe, Billy. Listen, me and Michael been Googling things, and if Dad really is an alien, there's only one way to get rid of him. Okay, okay, I'm calm. So how do we get rid of him? Google says that skinwalker aliens are highly, highly sensitive to jello. Why jello? And what will it do? It says there's an ingredient in jello that the alien skin can't handle. Yeah, and once the alien skin comes in contact with jello, they can't take over someone's body anymore. Then after that, lights out for the alien, and we got our dad back. So what are we going to do about this? What's the plan to get rid of the alien? Nothing. We're just going to deal with it. Me and Michael tried a bunch of times, but every time we got close, the alien would just wake up. Are you guys serious right now? So you're just going to give up and let an alien take over Dad's body? Yeah, we already tried enough, but that doesn't mean you can't try. The alien's sleeping on the couch right now. You guys are the worst sons ever. I'm going to go save Dad and then I'm going to be his favorite son. <laughs> Don't worry, Dad. I'm coming. <laughs> I can't believe he believed us. You did a really good job with that Photoshop picture of Dad going up in a UFO. Thanks, but it was your genius plan to try to convince Billy Dad was an alien. Okay, Billy, you can do this. Remember, just be brave. <laughs> <laughs> He's making weird alien noises. Okay, time to get rid of this alien. Huh? What the hell? Oh no, it didn't work. I must need more jello. Are you freaking kidding me? Darn it, Billy, why'd you just throw jello at my face? You're grounded. Ouch! Wait, so you're not an alien? No, I'm not an alien. Where's my belt at? Oh my god. <laughs> Tag, you're it, Cash. I bet you can't catch me. <laughs> Billy, what are you doing? Like I'm doing. I'm playing tag with my imaginary friend. You better look out. He's about to tag you. No, he's not because he's not real. Yes, he is. He's right there. And he just tagged you. That means you're it. No, I'm not it because I'm not playing, Billy. And once again, your imaginary friend is fake. No, he's not. He's real. You're just jealous. <gasps> you're right, Cash. He does have a big head. <laughs> he said I have a big head? He sure did, and he's calling you a bunch of other names, too, and he's going like this to you. Oh, really? Where'd you say he was? Right here? Yeah, he's right next to you. Oh, Cash, don't do that. Now he's flipping you the bird. <laughs> oh, really? Okay, take this, Cash. No, Tommy, stop. What are you doing? I'm teaching your friend a lesson, Billy. Take this, Cash. That's enough. He's tapping out, Tommy. Stop. Chunk slam. Oh, you're getting up, Cash? I guess you want some more. Crane kick! Tommy, stop it right now! Ah! 
I hope you know how to fly, Cash. Spinning tornado! Yeah. No! Ooh. That's a teach him. I can't believe you did that to Cash! I'm telling Mom! Mom! Tommy, did you beat your brother's imaginary friend up? You're grounded! Go to your room right now! Are you kidding me, Mom? But he's not even real! He's real to Billy, and that's all that matters! I'm not gonna say it again! You're grounded! Get up to your room right now! Fine, whatever, but that's bullshit! Hey boys, listen up. Me and your father are going out, so your grandfather's coming over to watch you. So make sure you guys are on your best behavior, okay? And also remember, he's been losing his memory lately, so keep an eye on him. Okay, Mom, have fun. Yes, I love when Grandpa comes over to watch us. He always falls asleep on the couch, and we get to do whatever we want. I don't think Grandpa would even care if he was awake. He would still let us do whatever we want. Oh yeah? Well, Grandpa falls asleep. I'm just gonna tell Mom everything you two do and get you both in trouble. What a little snitch. Can't you just be cool for once, Billy? I'm telling Mom that you called me a snitch. Of course you are. Hey boys, Grandpa's here. How y'all doing? Hi, Grandpa! How you been? Hey, what's up, Grandpa? Hey, Grandpa, did you watch the football game last night? Hey, boys, Grandpa's here. So what are you guys doing? Grandpa, you just said hi to us. Oh, sorry about that, boys. My memory's been going lately. I'm gonna go sit down on the couch and watch some TV. You boys be good now, you hear? Man, Grandpa's memory loss is really getting bad, isn't it? Yeah, it is. And listen, I'm not proud for what I'm about to say, but I think I got an idea that we can all benefit from. You already know I'm in. You gotta try to convince little Tattletail over there. Nope, I'm not doing it. And anything you guys do, I'm telling Mom. What if I told you I can get you some Robux, Billy? Robux? Okay, I'm listening. Alright, so you guys know how Grandpa's losing his memory? Here's the plan. A few minutes later. No way, that plan is genius. Dude, you're a savage. Guys, this is never gonna work! We're gonna get caught! It'll work, Billy, I promise. Just play it cool. Come on, let's hurry up and go before Grandpa falls asleep. Okay, let's see if there's anything good on the TV. Okay, good. He's still awake. I'll go first. Hey, Grandpa, how are you? Oh, I'm good. Just getting old, you know. What about you, Tommy? I'm good, Grandpa. I just had my birthday yesterday, so I'm really excited. I got a bunch of really cool things. Oh, no way. I missed your birthday? I'm sorry about that. Let me see if I got any money. Oh, here you go. Here's $20. Happy birthday. No way. Thanks, Grandpa. And it's okay that you missed it. It was nothing special. All right, I'll let you watch TV now. Guys, it worked. He gave me 20 bucks. All right, Michael, you're up next. Hey, Grandpa, anything good on? No, not yet. It says Pawn Stars is coming up next, so I'm just waiting for that. How you been, Michael? Oh, I love that show, Grandpa. And you know, same old, same old. My birthday was yesterday. Oh, no way. Was your birthday yesterday? Let me see if I got any money. Oh, here you go. Here's 20 bucks. Thanks, Grandpa. All right, you're up, Billy. Hey, Grandpa, guess what? Today's my birthday! Oh, happy birthday! Here you go, Billy! Guys, guys, guess what? Today's me and Mom's movie day, and she's not watching a movie with me! She's watching a movie with Riley! Oh, no, Billy, are you serious? We better call Channel 6 News! That's not funny, Tommy! This is serious! Why would Mom do that to me? It's because you're not Mom's favorite anymore, Billy. She replaced you with Riley. I used to have movie nights with mom until you were born, and then I got replaced. Don't say that, Michael. I'm still mom's favorite. She could never replace me. I'm one of a kind. Trust us, Billy. You've been replaced. And it's not a big deal. Who cares? Mom talks the whole time during movies anyway. You just got to deal with it now, Billy. You guys are wrong. You'll see. You're just jealous of mom's favorite. She could never replace me. Okay. Boys, me and Riley just finished our movie. I'm going to take her to the hair salon. Mom, can I go? I want a haircut. No, you can't go with us, Billy. Look at your hair. It's a tangled mess. You embarrass me. Just go get a brush and brush it. What? But you used to love my hair, Mom. Fine, whatever. A few hours later. Boys, we're home from the salon. Look at Riley's new haircut. Are you flipping kidding me? What's the matter, Billy? Don't you like it? Look how cute she looks. No, I don't like it, Mom. That's literally my same exact haircut. What are you talking about?
talking about, Billy? No, it's not. It's totally different. Oh, no. It's Billy 2.0. <laughs> Billy, I didn't know you had an identical twin. <laughs> hey, Billy, what's your favorite movie? The Replacements? <laughs> Knock it off, you guys! Oh, man, I think they're right. Mom is trying to replace me. Okay, I'm going to go make dinner. You guys play nice with your sister. We told you so, Billy. Welcome to the Middle Middle Child Club. That haircut doesn't even look good on you, Riley. I'm going to be Mom's favorite again soon. You'll see. <laughs> hey, Billy, you want to get some payback on Michael and pull a prank on him? Are you serious? Of course I want to pull a prank on Michael. You're really going to help me? Yeah, why not? I'll go get the stuff we need. I'll be right back. Okay, I'll be waiting right here. Oh, man, this is going to be epic. All right, I'm back. Here. Holy coca melons! Where did you get this nerf from? Grandma got it for me for my birthday. Man, Grandma always gets the best presents. This thing is so cool. But what are we going to do with it? What's the prank? All right, so Michael's on his way home from his friend's house, and as soon as he walks in that door, you're going to light him up. <laughs> That'll be so funny. He's not going to know what hit him. You're right, Billy. It's going to be hilarious. Why don't you get some practice shots in while you wait? Good idea. I better get my accuracy down. I don't want to miss. Nice shots, Billy. I think you got it down. Huh? I just heard a car door. That's Michael. Get in position. Okay, I'm ready. All right, now remember, as soon as he opens the door, open fire. Oh, what a long day at work. Eat lead! Ah! Ah, 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 ah. Huh? Nope, I was hiding here the whole time. We got you, Billy. <laughs> I can't believe you fell for that. Oh, Coca Melons. Dad, I'm sorry. It was an accident. Oh, what the heck? Are you kidding me? After a long day's of work, that's what I come home to. Billy, you're grounded. Oh, this isn't fair. <laughs> hey, guys, guess what? Guess what? Mom said we can get a dog. But we already have a dog. Its name is Billy, and it's not even potty trained. That's not funny, and I am too potty trained. I'm going to train my dog to bite you. Well, I got a little bit of bad news for you, Billy, but we can't get a dog. I'm allergic. Yeah, so what? We're still getting a dog. All right, I'm just trying to warn you. There's no way mom's going to let you get a dog. Didn't you hear me? I'm allergic. Yeah, well, we'll see about that. Mom! Dude, do you really think we're going to get a dog? We better not. Boys, guess what? We're home, and we have a new member of the family. Guys, check it out! We got a dog! But, Mom, we can't have a dog. I'm allergic. Oh, my goodness. I'm so sorry. I totally forgot. Well, it looks like one of you's going to have to go. Sorry, Billy. I hope you didn't name him yet. Bye-bye, puppy. Mom, there is no way I'm getting rid of this puppy. Look how cute he is. I think you know what you have to do. Oh, he is so cute. And don't worry, Billy. I know what to do. Michael, here's your suitcase. Get out. What? Are you kidding me, Mom? Sorry, Michael. You can come back when you're not allergic anymore. But, Mom, I'm always going to be allergic. That's bullshit. Mom, I think I'll name him Michael number two. That's a cute name. And why don't you take him upstairs? He can have Michael's old room. This is the weirdest family ever. Yo, Billy. Oh, my God. What are you doing? What's it look like I'm doing? I'm working out so I can get stronger, so I can take down Grandma. Dude, you're never going to be able to take Grandma down, and you're not even doing it right. Well, I don't know how to work out. What do you expect? It's my first time. Why don't you just follow our cousin Ava on TikTok? She's a bodybuilder. She's a beast. She'll teach you everything you need to know. Are you serious? Where's my phone at? I'm going to go follow her right now. i got to get strong. Yeah, good luck with that, Billy. I better call Grandma. Hey, Grandma, guess what? Holy coca melons! I didn't know Cousin Ava was this strong. Man, I'm gonna learn so much. Grandma will never be able to defeat me now. Hey, everybody, Grandma's here. Where are you at, Billy? Oh, there you are. Ouch, what are you doing here, Grandma? Did you really think you could train and get stronger than me? I don't think so. Who do you think trained Grandma? Your Cousin Ava. Are you serious? Ava's the one that trained you? Oh, Coca Melons, that's why Grandma's so strong. That's why my throwing arm's so strong. Watch. Ouch! Oh, man, you really do have a strong throwing arm. 
Everybody go follow Billy's cousin Ava. She makes awesome workout videos. And for every new subscriber she gets, I'll give Billy one of these. Uh oh! Ah! Yo, Michael, what are you doing? We're going to be late for school. Hurry up. All right, I'm done anyway. Check it out. I made a kick me sign. Now all I got to do is put it on Billy's back before he goes to school. You want to help? Now that's an old school prank. I like it. Of course I'll help. What do you need me to do? All I need you to do is distract Billy and I'll tape it to his back. All right, sounds good. Oh, I think he's coming down the stairs. Hey, has anybody seen my backpack? I need to hurry up. Yeah, I think I saw it behind the couch over here. Come on, I'll help you look. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Where is it? I don't see it. Here, let me help you look, Billy. I don't see it. I don't think it's back there. Oops, sorry. It was right here on the table. Here you go, Billy. Give me it. And remember, when I get home from school, you guys better not be watching TV. Mom said I can watch Cocomelon when I get home. <laughs> okay, bye, Mom. I love you. I'm going to school now. I can't believe you didn't notice. I know, right? I can't wait to get home from school to see how Billy's day was. I bet it's going to be a rough one. Come on, let's hurry up and get to the bus. Later after school. <laughs> I'm never going to school again. Today was the worst day ever. <laughs> Why, what happened, Billy? Everybody was just randomly kicking me all day. Even the teacher kicked me. <laughs> the teacher kicked you too? <laughs> hey, Billy, you got something taped to your back. Are you serious? What is it? A kick me sign? Did you guys put this on me? Yeah, why do you think we were trying to help you find your backpack? I'm telling mom! Boys, I can't believe you put this kick me sign on your brother's back before school. You're both grounded. Get up to your rooms. <laughs> totally worth it. Hey, Tommy, what's a snitch? Somebody called me that in school today. Oh, it just means you're a liar, Billy. Oh, now I get it. Hey, boys, who ate my favorite candy? I had one more piece left and I was saving it for after work. Uh-oh. Billy did that. Really, Tommy? You're a snitch. Oh, so it was you, Billy. Don't call your brother a snitch. He did the right thing telling me the truth. How many times do I got to tell you, don't eat my chocolate? You're grounded, Billy. Wait, what? Ah! Oh! <laughs> guys, guys, what are we going to do? Did you hear the news? They might shut down TikTok. Calm down, Billy. I doubt it's going to get shut down. Yeah, and even if it does, that's what we got a YouTube for. Oh, yeah, but wait. We have 8.7 million followers on TikTok, and on YouTube, we have like 1.1 million almost. So that means that 7.6 million of our followers don't follow us on YouTube! Hey everybody, Grandma's here. What's all the commotion about? I could hear you all the way in the driveway. Hi, Grandma. And that's just Billy you hear screaming. He's nervous that TikTok's gonna get shut down next month. Of course I'm nervous! Why is nobody else nervous? Grandma, 7.5 million of our followers don't follow our YouTube. Oh, well, that's not a problem, Billy. We're gaining subscribers pretty fast. That's why I'm throwing a sandal at your head for every new subscriber. Ouch! Oh, man, I forgot about that. Oh, would you look at that? Looks like we got another subscriber. You know what that means, Billy. Ouch! Knock it off, Grandma! Well, do you want to gain subscribers or not, Billy? Oh, man! I guess you're right. Go ahead, Grandma. Hey, Grandma. It looks like we just gained another subscriber. Oh, really? That's awesome. You know what that means. Ah! Go subscribe! This is awesome. I hope we go up like 5 million subscribers. Hey, Mom. Hey, Mom. Can I borrow your phone, please? I want to play Minecraft. Oh, sure thing, Billy. Here you go. Thanks, Mom. Time to put in Mom's passcode. Wait a minute. Why isn't it working? Mom, why isn't it working? I'm putting my birthday in. Oh, that's because I changed the passcode, Billy. It's not your birthday anymore. So, what'd you change your passcode to then, Mom? I changed it to Riley's birthday. Are you serious, Mom? You changed your passcode from my birthday to Riley's birthday? But I thought I was the favorite child. <laughs> <laughs> No, I'm busy. Why don't you ride your bike or something? I can't. It's too far. Well, then it looks like you're not going to the store. Oh, yeah. We'll see about that. I'm telling mom. Mom!
Hey, get your lazy butt up right now and take your brother to the store. Or I'm not giving you the car for the weekend. Uh, fine. Hurry up, nerd. I got things to do. That's what I thought. Thanks, Mom. Hey, wait for me. All right, hurry up and be quick. I don't got all day. Okay. Oh, yeah, I forgot. I don't have any money, so can I borrow some money? No, you can't borrow money. Are you kidding me? Why would you have me take you to the store if you don't have any money? We're going home. Oh, yeah, you want to bet? Hi, Mom. I forgot to bring my money, and Tommy won't let me borrow any money. Can you tell him to give me some money? She wants to talk to you. Oh, my God. Yeah, Mom. I don't have enough money, Mom. It's all the money I have to go out tonight. No, he won't pay me back. Fine, whatever. That's what I thought. Hurry up and give me my money. Here, I want all the change back, and I want all my money as soon as we get home. Do you understand? Yeah, whatever. I'll be right back. Keep the car running. Oh, my God. What is he doing? It's been 20 friggin' minutes. God. What do you want? Where's all your stuff? I don't have enough money. I need five more dollars. Give it to me. Hurry up. I gave you $20. How do you not have enough money? What'd you do? Break a window? No, you're not getting no more money. Oh, yeah? You want to bet? Hi, Mom. Yo, hang up. You're going to get me in trouble. Fine. I'll give you more money here. That's what I thought. Hey, I can't reach it. You can reach it. Just reach in a little farther. I'm in as far as I can go. Just give it to me. Come on, you almost got it. Just a little bit farther. I got you now. Come on, hurry up and give it to me. Oh, you're squishing me. What are you doing? Ah! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. My bad. My finger slipped. Here's the money. Okay, I have everything. Now you have to take me to the movies. What? No, I'm not driving you to the movies. I got things to do. I called mom in the store and she said that you have to take me. Do you want me to call her to prove it? No, don't call mom. Fine, whatever. I'll just drop you off, and then I have plenty of time to go out. Yes, I'm so excited to see this movie. I bought a bunch of candy to sneak in. <laughs> what are you doing? I'm eating candy. Duh. Whatever. Can I have a piece? No, this is mine. If you wanted candy, then you should have bought candy at the store. Technically, I paid for it, so it's mine. Whatever. I don't care. We're here. Hurry up and get out. I'm not allowed to go to the movies by myself. You have to go with me. No, I got things to do. Hi, Mom. Fine. And you have to buy the tickets. Billy, hurry up. You're going to miss the bus. Oh, my God. What are you doing? It's the 100th day of school today. You dress up like an old person. Check it out. I'm Grandma. <laughs> oh, are you kidding me, Billy? You better hope Grandma don't see you wearing her sweater and glasses. Eh, don't worry about it. I'll be long gone before Grandma ever notices. <laughs> Boys, has anybody seen my sweatshirt and my glasses? I can't see a dang thing. Wait a minute. Billy, what are you doing with my glasses and my sweatshirt on? Uh-oh! Today's dressed like an old person at school today, Grandma. So Billy took your stuff so we could look old. Oh, is it really? So what are you trying to say, Billy? I dress like an old lady? I may not have my glasses on, but I sure as heck won't miss that big head of yours. Now give me my glasses back. Ouch! Come on, Grandma! I just wanted to dress up for the 100th day of school. Fine, whatever, here! Ah, oh, there we go. That's better. Happy 100th day of school, everybody! We should do a Grandma takeover for the 100th day of school. And everybody should dress like Grandma. All you need is a long sleeve white t-shirt, and a fancy sweatshirt, and some really cool glasses. And don't forget to bring your slipper! Ah! Oh, man! Fine, I'll just go see if Grandpa has anything. <laughs> Tommy, how many times do I have to tell you? After you're done using a cup, put it in the dishwasher. You're grounded for a month. Get up to your room. But I wasn't done using it. I was going to get a drink later. Oh, what are you, a little smart Alec? Make that two months. Oh, man. Fine, whatever. What? Don't be disrespectful to your mother. You know what? You're grounded for the next year. Get up to your room. Are you serious? But I didn't even do anything. Oh, so now you're back talking to me? You know what? Go up to your room and don't come out until you're 18. Fine, whatever. Billy, sweetie, dinner's ready. <gasps> Billy, what are you doing? Were you playing ball in the house again? I told you, no more playing ball in the house. Yeah, I'm sorry, Mom. And then I accidentally kicked the ball too hard and I broke your lamp. See, this is why I told you we don't play ball in the house, Billy. Your grandmother gave me that lamp, and now I'll never be able to get a new one. I really don't want to have to do this, but you're grounded. 
Now get into the corner for two minutes. Oh, but mom, I don't want to be grounded. Two minutes in the corner right now, Billy. Ten seconds later. Man, this really stinks. There has to be a way I can get out of it. Oh, I know. Mom, mom, I'm really sorry. I'll never play ball in the house again. Can I stop being punished now? Oh, okay, sweetie. I think you learned your lesson. Your punishment is over. Come on out. <laughs> I'm such a sucker. <laughs> Boys, it's time to go get ready. We're going to grandma's soon. Ooh, I call first shower. No, I'm the oldest, so I get first shower. Plus, you always use all the hot water. Oh, yeah, well, then I guess first one to the shower gets in. <laughs> I'm getting in first. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like I'm getting in first. Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> well, that's my cue. Did you have a nice trip? I'll see you next fall! <laughs> oh, ooh, perfect. <laughs> oh! I'm getting in the shower first, Billy! Ouch! No, you're not! Stop! Get off of me! <laughs> I said get off of me! Uh-oh. Oh! Is that the shower? Oh, yeah, you're right. It is a shower. Where's Michael? <laughs> Works every time. Yes, it's Valentine's Day. One of my favorite holidays. Baby Cupid comes to visit me, and Mom's always my Valentine. I get so many presents. I'm so excited. <laughs> Whoa, look at all that stuff. Mom even got my favorite candy. Hey, what are you doing? Get your paws off of that stuff. It's not yours. That's for your sister, Riley. Oh, hi, Mom. Happy Valentine's Day. Holy moly. If all that's Riley's stuff, I can't even imagine how much stuff Mom got me. She probably got me a tons of stuff. Oh, yeah, here, Mom. I made this for you, since we're always each other's Valentines. Oh, thanks, but I'm not your Valentine this year, so I didn't get you anything. Riley's my Valentine this year. It's her first Valentine's Day. Now, let's see what you got me. Are you serious right now, Mom? Riley's your Valentine? I bet you she didn't even get you anything. I'm always your Valentine's mom. Yeah, well, not this year. Oh, look, you got me a frame. I could put a picture of Riley in this. Thank you, Billy. Really? You're going to put a picture of Riley in there? You know what, Mom? Give me my presents back. Okay, fine. You can have your picture frame back. I had a picture of a funny-looking kid in there anyway. That funny looking kid in there is me, Mom! What happened? I used to be your favorite! Yeah, yeah, whatever. Just be quiet. I think your sister's coming down the stairs. Oh my goodness, there she is! Look how cute Riley looks in her little Valentine outfit. Oh yeah, Riley! I forgot about you! Well, enjoy it while it lasts, because I'll be Mom's Valentine again soon! <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, guys. I shouldn't even ask. Okay, Billy, I'll bite. What's wrong? Why are you so upset? He probably just watched Free Willy again. Billy always cries when he watches Free Willy. That's because it's the best movie ever. Willy should have never made it over those rocks. But no, that's not it. Mom's not my Valentine's this year. Riley is. She didn't even get me anything. It's because you're the middle, middle child now, Billy. You're never going to get anything again. Welcome to the club. Yeah, that's why me and Michael teamed up. We're each other's Valentines. Since Mom never gets us anything, so we get each other something every year. We call it Brother Times Day. And oh yeah, Tommy, thanks for the new Nintendo game. It's awesome. Ah, uh, you're welcome, no problem. Thanks for the new camera. That sounds so cool! I wish I had a brother to have Brother Times Day with! Billy, you do have brothers. We had a feeling something like this was gonna happen, so we went out and got you something. Happy Brother Times Day! Welcome to the club. No, it's okay. You can keep that. Are you sure? Yeah, we're good. Hey, guys. You're going to be so jealous. I just spent all my birthday money on Robux, and then I gave it to one of my friends I met on Pet Simulator, and he's going to give me a bunch of really, really rare pets. Billy, why didn't you just put the Robux on your account and buy the pets yourself? Um, because he has really rare pets that you can't even get anymore. Duh. And exactly how much Robux did you send him? 
Didn't you just hear me? I spent all my birthday money. It was $1,000. I don't think he's going to give you the pets, Billy. I think you just got scammed. No, he didn't. He would never do that to me. We're literally best friends. I've known him for a week now. He said he had to get off and go eat dinner, and he'd be back on in 10 minutes. I can't believe you sent him $1,000 in Robux, Billy. Check your friends list. I bet you he removed you. Yeah, you definitely got scammed. No, I didn't. Watch. You'll see. Let me see. What? Where'd he go? Oh, no, guys. He removed me as a friend. I can't believe you fell for that, Billy. We tried to tell you. I can't believe it. I just lost all my birthday money and my road books. Ah! Ouch, Billy. Oh, no, he's about to blow. Take cover. No! Ah! Tommy, we have to get out of here. Hey guys, guess what? Mom said I'm finally old enough to watch Stranger Things. I don't think that's a good idea, Billy. You're scared of your own shadow. Yeah, I wouldn't watch it if I was you, Billy. You're definitely going to be scared. No, I'm not. I'm not going to get scared. And I'll prove it to you guys right now. I'm going to go binge watch all the seasons. <laughs> He's 100% going to be sleeping in Mom's room for the next five months. 100%. But this gives me an idea to pull a prank on Billy. Let me see your phone. I got to order something. Yeah, here you go. So what's the plan? We're going to scare Billy. Oh, no way. This is perfect. I'm definitely going to order it. A few days later. Oh, yes. Our delivery's here. Nice. That's perfect timing. Billy's finishing season four right now. You go get everything set up and I'll bring it inside. Yes, I did it. I made it through all the seasons without even getting scared. I can't wait to go tell my brothers. Guys, hey, guys, guess what? Ah! No freaking way. Vecna's after me! Ah! Michael! Michael, come quick! I have to show you something! What is it, Billy? I'm busy. I'm about to play Fortnite. Vecna's after me, Michael! There's a grandfather clock down in the living room! Come on, hurry up! What are you talking about, Billy? There's no grandfather clock downstairs. It's probably your imagination. We told you you were going to get scared. I promise there's a grandfather clock downstairs! Come on, I'll prove it to you! Fine, whatever, Billy. Come on, stop being so scared. See, I told you, there's no clock in there. Huh? Where'd it go? I promise, Michael, it was right there. I think you're losing it, Billy. Now leave me alone. I'm going to go play Fortnite. Maybe it was my imagination. Well, whatever it was, it's gone now. I should go get something to eat. All right, Tommy, phase one is complete. Time to move on to phase two. Oh, I'm so ready for this. I got all the wires and everything hooked up. Come on, let's go. This would make me feel better. <laughs> huh? Please no, please no, please no! Ah! I gotta get out of here! Alright, Tommy, I'm all hooked up. Go get the clock and call Billy in. Billy, come quick! Something's wrong with Michael! What? What's wrong with my- Oh my goodness! It's Vecna! He got Michael! I told you guys there was a grandfather clock! Oh no, Billy, what are we gonna do? Did you scare your brother? You're both grounded. Get up to your rooms. <laughs> totally worth it. <laughs> Yo, Michael, have you seen my... What are you doing with Billy's fruit snacks? He got me grounded yesterday, so I'm pulling a prank on him. You want to help? Yeah, I want to help. What do you need me to do? Just go sit down on the couch and wait for me. I'm almost done. I'll be right there. All right. So what's the plan? We've been waiting here for like 30 minutes. Trust me. We just got to wait a little bit longer. I don't want to spoil the surprise yet. All right, if you say so. I got fruit snacks! I got fruit snacks! Hey, Michael, what are you doing down here? Aren't you supposed to be in your room grounded? <sighs> yeah, thanks to you. What, are you going to tell Mom I'm downstairs and get me grounded even more? You know what? That actually sounds like a good idea! <gasps> Ma! No way, what just happened to Billy? I can't believe it worked. I put a melatonin in his fruit snacks. Come on, help me carry him out. Dude, you're a genius. Where are we carrying him? Out to the car. Grab his legs. I got his arms. Come on. Alright, just be careful. Oh no, he's slipping! Oops. 
All right, come on, we gotta be more careful. All right, so where are we going? Just get on the highway. I'll show you where to go. Okay. A few hours later. All right, we're here. Pull over. Is Billy still sleeping? Let me check. <laughs> Coca melon. <laughs> yeah, he's still sleeping. All right, perfect. Help me get him out of the car. All right, he's out. Are you sure we should leave him here? Yeah, don't worry about him. He'll be fine. Come on, let's get in the car and go home. We can play Fortnite now. All right, if you say so. Bye, Billy. Huh? I wonder where I am. Why'd I fall asleep all of a sudden? Uh, oh, no. Are you kidding me? I'm in Ohio. Boys, I just had to drive all the way to Ohio to pick your brother up. Did you boys make your brother fall asleep and drive him to Ohio? You're both grounded. Get up to your rooms. <laughs> totally worth it. Yo, Michael, do you still have them walkie-talkies you got from a couple Christmases ago? Yeah, probably. Why? I want to play a prank on Billy. Can you go find him for me? Yeah, I'll go find him, as long as you let me help. Of course you can help. I'm going to start getting things ready. All right, Tommy, I found the walkie-talkies, so what's the prank? Oh, perfect. Well, you know how Billy's terrified of Chucky? Yeah. So, I bought this Chucky doll, and we're going to put one of the walkie-talkies in it and make Billy think that Chucky's alive. No way, bro, you're a genius. Billy's going to be terrified. Here's the walkie-talkie. Thanks. Okay, now all we got to do is hide it in his shirt. And there we go. And now that it's all set up, all we got to do is wait for Billy. Come on, Stitch. Let's go get a snack. <gasps> oh, no. What the heck is Chucky doing here? <laughs> Watch this. Hi, Billy. My name's Chucky. Do you want to play with me? Holy freaking Cocomelons! That Chucky doll's alive! No, I don't want to play with you, Chucky! Let me see the walkie-talkie. I got a good one. Watch this. Yeah, that's right, Billy. I am alive. My soul got trapped into this Chucky doll. And if you don't play with me, I'm going to break all your Cocomelon toys. And then I'm going to take your soul. Okay, okay, I'll play with you. Just whatever you do, don't break my Cocomelon toys. So what do you want to play first? Oh, I got a good one. Get your phone ready to record. First, I want you to dance and sing around saying, I like to eat boogies. I like to eat boogies. Ew, no, I'm not singing that. Do it or I'll take your soul. <laughs> okay, okay, don't take my soul. I like to eat boogies. I like to eat boogies. <laughs> no way, I can't believe he's actually doing it. This is going to go viral on TikTok. Okay, enough. Now I want you to run to the kitchen and get me all the fruit roll-ups. Okay, okay, I'll be right back. <laughs> I'm back, I'm back. Here, I got you the entire box. Nice call with the fruit roll-ups. Watch this one. Now I want you to go upstairs and get me all the money out of your piggy bank. Right now. No way, that's all my birthday money I've been saving. I've been saving it for five years. Get me the money or give me your soul. Okay, okay, I'll get the money. Ah! I'm back. Here's all my money. Take it. Good job, Billy. Since I did a good job, does that mean you're not going to take my soul? No, I'm still going to take your soul. Now get over here. Ah! Somebody help! <laughs> I can't believe he fell for it. I know, that was the best prank ever. By the way, here's your half of Billy's birthday money. Thanks. We should do pranks more often. You're right. We make a good team. We sure do. Hey, Tommy! Hey, Tommy! Check it out! Mom just got me a Nerf! Ouch! Are you serious, Billy? Knock it off. You better not do that again. <laughs> oh, yeah? What are you going to do about it? Oh, all right. That's it. Don't say I didn't warn you, Billy. Say goodnight, Billy. Wait, Tommy, no! Where'd you get that from? Ah! Ouch! 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 Stop! Knock it off! Ah! Billy, have you seen? Where'd you get all that money from? Oh, this money? I actually found a good use for Riley. Okay, and that doesn't explain how you got the money. Well, ever since I became the middle middle child, I'm not allowed to go in Mom's purse and take her money anymore. I'll get grounded. So, for the past couple weeks, I've been training Riley to go in Mom's purse and get me her money. Dude, you know eventually you're going to get caught, right? No, I'm not, because I don't even go near Mom's purse. If anybody gets caught, it's going to be Riley, and she's just going to think it's a mistake. Watch, I'll show you how it's done. Oh, Riley, come here! 
Riley, come here. Hurry up. Hurry up, Riley. I got a mission for you. Okay, Riley. Remember what I was teaching you? See this money right here? Go in mom's purse and get me more of this money. Go, go, go. get caught here's twenty dollars to keep your mouth shut i can't believe that worked all right billy you got a deal i won't tell mom but i want 20 percent of everything you get you got yourself a deal all right boys i'm going to work i'll be home later and somebody turn that light off what do you got stock in the electric company okay bye dad have a good day you heard him billy get up and turn the light off no i'm playing minecraft you get up and turn the light off no, I'm sitting down. You're right there, Billy. You're closer. Just turn the light off. Oh, yeah? Well, guess what? <laughs> now you're closer. You get up and turn the light off. Oh, you want to play that game? Okay. Well, guess what, Billy? Now you're closer. You go turn the light off. No, I'm not. <laughs> now you're closer. You go turn it off. Oh, yeah? Well, now you're closer. You go turn it off. I already told you, I'm not turning the light off. We can do this all day. Watch! <laughs> now you're closer. You go turn the light off. There is no way I'm turning that light off. Now you're closer, Billy. You go turn the light off. I already said no. <laughs> now I'm not even in our neighborhood anymore. So that means you're closer. You go turn the light off. I'd rather get eaten by sharks than lose and turn that light off. Time to order a plane ticket. Now you're closer, Billy! You go turn the light off! Boys, I'm home from work! Are you freaking kidding me? Nobody turn that light off! Bro, I can't believe Grandma got you the new PS5 for your birthday. I know, this is so cool. Oh, he's over near me. Grandma's the best. Hey, what are you guys doing? Are you serious? Tommy, you hooked up the PS5? Why didn't you come tell me? I got next! Yeah, right, Billy. You must be out of your mind. I'm never letting you touch my PS5 with your Dorito fingers. I only do that so I can save some for later. That Dorito dust is delicious! Come on, plus I don't even have that much on my fingers right now. I'll lick it off, watch! Ew, no, now you're definitely not touching my controller. Yeah, just look at your iPad. Your screen protector is just a layer of slimy Dorito dust. No, it's not. Come on, guys. Look, my fingers are clean. I got next. Oh, Tommy, you died. Give me the controller. No, I said you're not playing. Now get out of here, Ice Spice. Mom already told you to stop calling me that. I told you a million times. I've had this haircut first. She copied off of me. Now give me the controller. I'm telling Mom. Okay, go and tell Mom then, Napoleon Dynamite. I already told you. You're not playing. Now get out of here. Fine. You asked for it. I'm going to go tell her right now. Hold on, wait, Billy. That's what I thought. You don't want to get in trouble. Now give me the controller. No, I don't care about that. I just wanted to tell you. Don't forget to tell Mom about this. Ouch! Now you're in big, big trouble! Mom! Nice throw, man. Thanks. I've been practicing. Want to play again? Dude, I'm down to play all night. Hey, Tommy, listen. You're going to share the game with your brother and you're going to let him play. And you're lucky it's your birthday, so I'm not going to ground you for throwing a sandal at him or calling him Ice Spice. Mom, but it's mine. I don't want him touching it. He'll break it. I'm not going to say it again. You're sharing your game system with your brother, and you're going to let him play the next game. And I'm going to stand here and watch and wait to make sure he does play the next game. Are you kidding me? Fine, whatever. <clears throat> I told you I would play. I got next! I got next! Michael, start building a sky base. We need to buy time. I want to text Grandma. Okay, I got you. Alright, I sent a text. Hopefully she sees it in time. We need to make this game last as long as possible. Oh, I got a text from my grandbaby. I wonder if he's playing the new PS5 I got him. <gasps> what? Oh, hell no. Don't worry, sweetie. Grandma's on her way. Grandma texted me back. She's coming over. Hopefully no one sees us up here. Ten minutes later. Oh man, there's only one team left and the storm is too small. We're gonna have to jump down and fight it out. Okay, let's get this W. Hopefully Grandma makes it in time. Oh, wow, you boys won. Good job. Now, Tommy, give the controller to your brother.
I guess she's not gonna make it. If he wants it, he can come get it. Yes, it's my turn! Hey, step away from that controller! Ow! Mom, what was that for? Ow! That's Tommy's PlayStation and he doesn't have to share with anybody. You understand? Okay! Thanks, Grandma! Hey, guys! Mom said I have to watch my iPad in here! Okay. Michael, I'm serious. I think we should tell him. No way, Tommy. We made a promise to Mom that we would never tell. Plus, I don't think he'd be able to handle it. Now stop talking about it. No way! You guys have a secret with Mom? Who is it about? I want to know everything! Spill the tea! Wait a second. It's not about me, is it? Good one, Tommy. Look what you did now. He's asking questions. No, don't worry, Billy. It's not about you. Michael, I think it's time that he knows the truth. Look at him. He's getting older. He's going to figure it out on his own. I say we just tell him. I knew it! It is about me! Come on, guys! You have to tell me! I promise I won't freak out or say anything! I don't think we can, Billy. Michael might be right. Come on, you have to tell me! I'll do your chores for a month, and I'll give you my birthday money here! Let me see. Yeah, it's real, Michael. What do you want to do? Should we tell him? Yeah, we can tell him. Yes! All right, I'm all ears! Tell me the secret! All right, so when you were born, Billy, you were born with an identical twin. No way! Are you serious? I have an identical twin? Who is it? I can't believe I'm doing this. I made a promise to Mom, but Billy, your identical twin sister is Ice Spice. Holy friggin' Cocomelons! My twin sister is famous! I always thought she looked familiar! No wonder I'm so good looking! My sister's famous! My sister's famous! Shh, Billy, keep your voice down. Mom might hear you. See, I told you we shouldn't have told him. Okay, okay, I'll keep my voice down. So, does she even know that she's my twin sister? Yeah, she knows. She's gonna use you as a body double just in case anything happens, like she gets sick and can't perform on stage or something. No way! I always knew I was destined for greatness! That's probably why I'm mom's favorite. Wait a second, but if I'm gonna be up on stage, I'm gonna need to practice! Yeah, that's why I wanted to tell you, Billy. That way when you do go up there, you don't make a fool of yourself. Man, you guys are lifesavers! Thank you so much! I better bust out the karaoke! <laughs> okay, guys, how's this? I tried to dip, but he begged me to stay! Bae, I'm not staying, I just can't- <laughs> This is going right on TikTok. I think you gotta put a little bit more into it, Billy. He begged me to stay! Bae, I'm not staying, I just can't- I can't believe it, this is gold. <laughs> yeah, that's it, Billy. That's the one right there. Man, that was a hard rehearsal, but I think I got it down perfect. I can't wait to tell everybody in school tomorrow that I have a famous twin sister. Man, I'm gonna be so cool. I can't wait. I'm going to bed right now. <laughs> okay, good night. And it's uploaded to TikTok. The next day. <laughs> I'm never going to school again. Why, what happened, Billy? You guys lied! Ice Spice isn't really my sister! And then you posted that video of me online! Everybody kept calling me Ice Spice Dupe in school today! <laughs> Holy freaking Cocomelons! Did you guys see? Northwest watches our series! Living with Siblings! Billy, what are you talking about? Yeah, there's no way she watches Living with Siblings. Yes, yeah, she does! And I'll prove it to you! Look at this TikTok she made! She is literally cosplaying me right now! Oh my god, he can't be this stupid. She's not cosplaying you, Billy. She's cosplaying Ice Spice. Why would she ever want to pretend to be you? What are you talking about? Ice can't be spicy. Ice is cold. And yes, she is cosplaying me! You guys are just jealous that I'm her favorite character. And she didn't cosplay any of you! <laughs> Trust me, we're not jealous, Billy. Oh man, do you guys know what this means? Maybe Kim will invite me over for a play date with Northwest! She could choose anybody in the world to have a play date with, and you really think she's gonna pick you? Of course she would! I'm literally the coolest person in the world! Oh man, I better go gather up some of my best toys, just in case Kim calls! <laughs> you know what? I actually do hope Kim calls. Maybe she'll adopt Billy. We could never get that lucky. I'm gonna text Grandma and tell her what's going on. Okay, I'm back! I packed up some of my best toys. Now all I gotta do is sit back and wait for the phone call from Kim. <laughs> hey everybody, Grandma's here. Oh, there you are, Billy. Hey, what was that for, Grandma? That's for thinking that you would be Nord's favorite character in this series. Clearly, I would be her favorite character. No, you wouldn't. I would be her favorite character. I'm literally the funniest person in the family. Oh, be quiet, Billy. Ah! Oh, stop your whining, Billy. I'm getting a phone call. Oh, that's weird. It's a California number. 
Let me see who it is. Hello? Oh my goodness, hi Kim, how are ya? Yes, I would love to come over and babysit Northwest. I'll get on the plane as soon as I can. Okay, I'll see you soon, bye-bye. No way, this isn't fair! You're going to babysit Northwest? Take me with you, Grandma! No, you can't come with me, Billy. And don't call me Grandma no more. Call me Grandma Kardashian from now on. What are you doing? Get out of my room. What are you talking about? I'm not even in your room, see? That's your room right there. So, I'm clearly in the hallway. I'm not in your room. Oh, my God. Fine, whatever. But you better not step foot in my room. Okay, I won't step in your room. What did I just get done telling you? You're clearly in my room. Now get out. You said don't step foot in your room. And I didn't step foot in your room. I'm just sticking my head in and looking around. I don't want your big head peeking around in my room either. Back up. Okay, jeez, calm down. I wasn't even in your room. Did you just flick a boogie in my room? Yeah, if I'm not allowed in your room to wipe boogies on your pillow, how else am I supposed to get boogies in there? I gotta flick them from the door. You wipe your boogies on my pillow? Yeah, I'm not gonna wipe them on my pillow. That would be disgusting. Ouch! I'm telling Mom! Mom! Tommy just hit me with a pillow! Tommy, did you just hit your brother with a pillow? Yeah, he kept coming in my room and bothering me, and then he flipped a boogie in here. Well, that doesn't mean you get to throw a pillow at him. You're grounded for the next month, and your brother, he's allowed in this room whenever he wants. Do you hear me? But, Mom, that's not fair. You want to make it two months? No, fine, whatever. <laughs> now you can't stop me from coming in here at all. Wow, what a nice room you got. I think I'm going to play Fortnite on your computer. I can't wait to go to college. Boys, I have to run a couple errands. On the way home, I'll stop and get you all an ice cream cone. What flavors do you want? I'll have chocolate. I'll take strawberry, Mom. Yes! I love ice cream! Hold on, Mom. Let me think. Hmm. What flavor do I want? Um, I'll do chocolate. No, wait! I want vanilla! Okay, so chocolate, strawberry, and vanilla. I'll be back in a little bit. You boys be good. Wait, Mom! Hold up! Actually, I want chocolate! Okay, I can get you chocolate. Are you sure that's what you want? Actually, never mind. I'll go with vanilla. We're getting ice cream. We're getting ice cream. Okay, boys, I'm home. Here's your ice cream. Oh, give me mine first. Oh, this looks so good. Oh, sweet. Thanks, Mom. Yeah, thanks, Mom. Man, this looks so good. Chocolate's my favorite flavor. Chocolate's my favorite flavor, too. I knew I should have got chocolate ice cream. Mom, I want chocolate ice cream. Tell Tommy to switch with me. No, I'm not switching with you. You were just licking your ice cream, getting your slobber all over it. Plus, I can't have vanilla. I'm allergic. Next time, just get chocolate. Mom, tell him we're not switching. Tommy, just be a good big brother and switch ice creams with your brother. He made a mistake. He wants chocolate. Give him the chocolate ice cream. Are you kidding me? But then I don't get any ice cream. I can't eat vanilla, Mom. I'm allergic. Well, then I guess you're going to have to wait till the next time we get ice cream if you want ice cream. Now give your brother the ice cream. I'm not going to tell you again. Fine, whatever. Here you go, Billy. Yes! And Mom, since Tommy can't have vanilla, does that mean I get to eat both of these ice cream cones? Sure thing, Billy. You can eat both of them. Sorry about that, Tommy. You want to lick a mine? No, I'm good. Thanks, though. I'm texting Grandma. Oh, I got a text from my grandbaby. I wonder what he wants. <gasps> oh, hell no. Don't worry, sweetie. Grandma's on her way. <laughs> I have two ice creams. You have no ice creams. I have two ice creams. You have no ice creams. <laughs> Shut up, Billy. Hey, everybody. Grandma's here. Where's Billy at? Oh, there you are. Ouch! Are you kidding me, Grandma? You just made me drop my ice cream. <laughs> Good! You don't deserve any ice cream! Now where's my daughter at? Yes, Grandma's here! Billy, what are you crying for? Oh, hi, Mom! What are you doing here? Oh, there you are! Ouch, Mom! What was that for? That's for giving Billy Tommy's ice cream! Now you and Billy, get up to your rooms! You're grounded! <laughs> this isn't fair! <laughs> now come on, 
boys. I'll take you and Michael out to get more ice cream, and then we can go see a movie. Really? Thanks, Grandma. You're the best. Hey, Billy, Mom said, oh, my God, what are you doing? What's it look like I'm doing? I'm playing the floor is lava. Duh. Okay, and where are you trying to get to? I'm glad you asked. So, you start on top of the table, and then... You gotta jump on this chair, then jump across to the next chair, then land on the pillow, then walk across the box, and land safely on the couch. Isn't this the coolest floor is lava obstacle course? You wanna play with me? No, I don't wanna play. You're gonna end up getting hurt, Billy. But I will stand here and watch. What, are you allergic to having fun? Whatever. You're lost. Okay, are you ready? Watch this! Wait, hold up. Actually, I gotta record this. Okay, now I'm ready. Go ahead, go. Good idea! And then we can submit the video to the TV show The Floor is Lava. And after they see my wicked skills of passing this course, maybe they'll invite me on the TV show to be a contestant! Okay, here I go! <laughs> Good one, Billy! They're really gonna let you on the show now! I can't believe I got that on camera! I gotta send that to Grandma! It's not funny! I'm telling Mom! Mom! Tommy, I can't believe you didn't try to stop your brother from playing The Floor is Lava and jumping all over the furniture! You know what? You're grounded! Get up to your room! Are you kidding me? He wouldn't listen to me if I told him to stop! And did he get grounded for jumping on the furniture? No, he didn't get grounded. He learned his lesson when he fell and got a boo-boo. He's in the other room eating ice cream right now so he could feel better. Are you kidding me? He didn't get in trouble, but I did? I didn't even do anything. You know what? Whatever, Mom. At least I got the video. Hey, Tommy! I got a question for you. Are you smart? I'm smarter than you. Oh, really? Well, if you're so smart, then spell it! S-M-A-R-T <laughs> I knew you weren't smart! I said spell it! Not spell smart! <laughs> you're stupid! <laughs> no, that was a lame joke. You're stupid. Did you really just call me stupid? That was so mean of you! I'm telling Mom! Mom! Tommy, did you call your brother stupid? Yeah, but only because he called me stupid first. Well, two wrongs don't make a right. You're grounded. Get up to your room right now. Are you kidding me? Is he getting grounded for calling me a name? No, he's not getting grounded. You're older. You should know better. Now get up to your room. That's bullshit. <laughs> yes! It's Easter morning! That means the Easter Bunny came, and we're gonna have an Easter egg on! I better hurry up and get downstairs! <laughs> everybody! Everybody! Hurry up! We gotta go outside and have our Easter egg on! I already got my basket! I'll meet you all out front! I don't even know why we bother. Every year, Mom lets Billy get all the eggs, and we get nothing. Yeah, that's true, but I think this year's gonna be a little bit different. Billy's not the youngest child anymore. Riley is. I totally forgot about that. It's Riley's first Easter. You know what? This Easter egg hunt might not be too bad after all. This should be good. Come on, let's hurry up and get outside. Whoa! Look at all the eggs! Everybody, hurry up! It's time for the Easter egg hunt! Okay, okay, calm down, Billy. You have to wait for Riley. It's her very first Easter. I'm so excited! Are you ready to get some eggs, Riley? Oh yeah, I forgot about Riley. Well, hurry up and put her down, Mom. I'm ready to get started. Okay, just give me a second. Is everybody ready? Dude, this is going to be so good. I don't even think Billy realizes what's going to happen. I know. I've been waiting all my life for this. Okay, everybody go. Finally, it's about time, Mom. I'm going to get all the eggs. <laughs> this one's mine. This one's mine. Riley, what are you doing? Give me that egg. This is my egg! You gotta be faster than that! Billy Joseph, what are you doing? Don't take your sister's eggs! This is your sister's Easter egg hunt! Not your Easter egg hunt! Now put all the eggs that you got back on the ground! Are you serious, Mom? That's not fair! These are all my eggs! It's not my fault she's not fast enough to get all the eggs! Don't back talk me, Billy! You're grounded! Now you're not getting any eggs! Now put your eggs back on the grass right now! And after you're done putting all the eggs back, get up to your room! This isn't fair! I always get all the eggs on Easter! Fine, whatever! Here, Riley, you can have all the eggs! Billy, I can't believe you would do that to your sister! You know what? Now you're grounded for two months! Get up to your room! <laughs> Welcome to being the middle middle child, Billy! <laughs> yeah, now you know how we felt all those years. We didn't get eggs. There you go, Riley. Go ahead and pick up all the eggs. Happy Easter, everybody! Hey, Billy, you want to go outside and have a catch? Oh, my heart. I think I'm having a heart attack. 
Nice try, Dad. I know it's April Fool's. You're not going to trick me. Billy, call for help. Dad, I already told you. You're not going to trick me. Plus, you're a really bad actor. Hey, Billy, have you seen... Oh, my God, what's wrong with Dad? Nothing's wrong with him. He's just trying to pull an April Fool's joke on me. Dad, Dad, are you okay? Somebody call an ambulance. <laughs> Tommy, I can't believe you fell for Dad's April Fool's prank. You're so gullible. What's all the commotion about? What's going on? I don't know. I just walked in and I found Dad like this. Michael, hurry up and call an ambulance. Dad, Dad. Okay, I'll go get my phone. Good one, Dad. You tricked Tommy and Michael, but you can't trick me. Now stop messing around and get up. Okay, Dad. Come on. The prank's over. You can get up now. Dad, Dad. Uh-oh. A few days later. We are gathered here today. Too late to rest. <laughs> this is all your fault, Billy. Yeah, if you would have helped Dad right away, maybe they could have saved him. I'm sorry. I thought it was an April Fool's joke. <laughs> hey, Billy. April Fool's. <laughs> Ouch. Are you serious? So it was an April Fool's joke. <laughs> April Fool's, Billy. <laughs> I told you we would fall for it. Where is it? Where is it? Yes, ten bucks. Man, that should get me a lot of Robux. I wonder if Mom has any more money. You can never have enough Robux. Yo, Billy. Ah! Oh, you scared me. I thought you were a mom. No way, I can't believe it. I just caught you red-handed taking Mom's money out of her purse. What? No, uh -uh. no, I wasn't. I was looking for gum. That is a lie. Say cheese. Oh man, you forgot to smile. Tommy, I'm not messing around. Delete that picture right now. No way, I'm not deleting it. Matter of fact, I'm going to make it my home screen. Do you really think I'm not going to tell mom after all the times you got me and Michael in trouble? Come on, Tommy. Please delete it. Don't you have a heart? I'm going to get in so much trouble. Mom will probably never let me play Roblox again. Delete it, please. I'll do anything, I promise. All right, fine. You know what? I'll make a deal with you, Billy. I won't show Mom this picture, but for the next month, you got to do whatever I say. Okay, fine. You got yourself a deal. Please, just don't tell Mom. Don't worry, I won't tell her, as long as you do everything I say. I promise, I will. Thank you so much for not telling on me. No problem, Billy. You're going to wish I told on you by the time I'm done with you. Phew, that was a close one, but I still got my ten bucks. Time to go buy my Robux! <laughs> I'm home from baseball practice, everybody. Hey, Billy, where are you at? Get in here. Yeah, what do you want, Tommy? I was playing Roblox. Excuse me? What did you call me? That's not how you're supposed to greet me. I'm sorry. Yes, almighty great one who is way better than me and cooler and smarter and more handsome than me. What do you want? Now that's more like it. So I just got home from practice. And my dogs are barking. I need you to rub my feet. Ew, no way. I'm not rubbing your nasty feet. Okay, if you say so. I guess I'm just going to have to text this picture to mom then. Wait, hold up. I'm sorry. Don't send that to mom. Okay, I'll rub your feet. That's what I thought. And don't forget to clean in between my toes. Ew. Okay, I'm all done. I'm going to go get back to my game now. Boys, dinner's in 15 minutes. And Tommy, don't forget it's trash night. I want you to take the trash out right now. Okay, no problem, Mom. Billy, you heard, Mom. Go take the trash out. Oh man. Fine. Okay, boys, dinner is served. Billy, isn't there something you want to say to everybody? Thanks for reminding me. I almost forgot. So I wanted to tell everybody that Tommy is way smarter than me and more handsome than me. And he's better at everything than me. And... And I smell. Okay, boys, here we go. This is our new home. Whoa, this house is awesome. I'm going to go pick out my room. I guess I'll sleep on the couch. Michael, what are you talking about? This house is bigger than our last one. You get your own room. What? Are you serious, Mom? I get my own room? <laughs> I can't believe it. I never had my own room. Tommy, wait for me. I got my own room. <laughs> Are you guys serious? You guys left me at the old house. I had to run all the way here and chase the moving truck. 
Oh, sorry about that. There was a lot going on. We must have forgot about you. Are you serious? How could you forget about me, Mom? I used to be your favorite child. You know what? Fine. Whatever. It doesn't matter. I'm going to go pick out my new bedroom. <laughs> Whoa, this room is cool. I'll take this room. I don't think so, Billy. This is my room. Get out. Oh, man. Whatever. I'll just go find another room. <laughs> Whoa, this room looks really cool. You know what? This will be my room. Not a chance, Billy. This is my room. Mom finally said I could have my own bedroom. Go look somewhere else. Aw, oh, man, fine! I think there's one more bedroom left. I better get there quick. <laughs> Here we go. Home sweet home. This is definitely going to be my room. I might need to paint the walls and change a couple things, but I can definitely see myself living here. Billy, what are you doing? This is Riley's room. Get out! What? Are you serious, Mom? But there's no more bedrooms left! Where am I supposed to sleep? I don't know, Billy. How about you go sleep in the basement or something? Are you kidding me, Mom? The basement? I don't want to sleep in the basement! This is all your fault, Riley! <laughs> Fine! I'll get out! But this isn't over! I'll have my own room soon! <laughs> the basement! It sure is spooky down here. I can't believe I have to sleep down here. Well, I guess here's my room. Oh, man, this really stinks. Hey, boys, check it out. Somebody's moving in next door. We're going to have new neighbors. No way, are you serious? I hope they have a kid my age. That way I have someone to play with, and I can have a new best friend. Billy, to have a new best friend, you need an old best friend, and you don't have any friends. Yes, I do. You just don't know them. They go to a different school. Honestly, I don't care who moves in next door. I'm just glad we don't live next to Mrs. Jenkins anymore. Yeah, I'm with you on that one. It's been so peaceful around here. We've been able to do anything we want. Yeah, yesterday I was riding my quad out front, and nobody called the cops on me. It was a perfect day. Well, boys, listen up. Since we're new to the neighborhood, and there are new neighbors, I want you boys to go over there and introduce yourselves. Oh, Mom, are you kidding me? I don't feel like going over there and being social. I was about to go play Fortnite. Come on, Michael, it'll be fun. Maybe our new neighbors have a bunch of toys we can play with. Michael, I'm not going to say it again. Go over there and meet the new neighbors, or you're not playing Fortnite for the rest of the week. Fine, whatever. I'm going to get there first. That way I can become their best friend. <laughs> oh, my God, Billy's going to scare the new neighbors away. <laughs> okay, guys, stay back. I'm going to be the first one to knock. Hello, it's your new neighbors! Oh, hiya, boys! <laughs> oh no, Mrs. Jenkins broke into our new neighbor's house! Mrs. Jenkins, what are you doing here? I didn't break into your neighbor's house, you noodle brains. I am your new neighbor. Welcome to the neighborhood, boys! <laughs> no! Now you boys got five seconds to get off my porch before I call the cops. You boys are trespassing! Okay, okay, we're leaving, Mrs. Jenkins. Don't call the cops. Come on, guys. Guys, I can't believe this. What are we going to do? So, boys, did you meet the new neighbor? Tell me all about them. Mom, you're not going to believe this. Our new neighbor is Mrs. Jenkins. No way. I can't believe it. What a small world. I didn't even know she was selling her house. Well, this is going to be great. Now we have a neighbor that we know, and that way I can get a babysitter for you boys. I think you drank too much coffee today, Mom. It must be getting to your head. Mrs. Jenkins is the worst neighbor in all of history. And why would you ever want the Blair Witch to babysit us? Yeah, Mom, she probably bought the house next door so she can keep getting us in trouble. Oh, you boys have such a wild imagination. I'm sure it was just a kawinky dink. Now I'm going to go make dinner. You boys better behave. I can't believe this. Our lives are ruined. What are we going to do? We have to get Mrs. Jenkins out of this neighborhood. I don't know, Billy, but we gotta do something. I can't believe those boys really thought they could get away from me. They're done for it. <laughs> hey, Tommy! Tommy! Mom said you have to take me to the store so I can buy some Prime. No, I'm busy. I'm not taking you to the store. Ride your bike or something. And are you even old enough to drink Prime? Are you crazy? I'm not riding my bike to the store. It's like 10 miles away. And yeah, Mom said I'm allowed to try it. It's going to be my very first time. I'm going to go tell Mom you're not going to take me. Mom! Tommy, you're going to take your brother to the store so he can buy his Prime, and that's final. Now take him to the store. Fine, whatever. Come on, Billy. Yes! 
All my friends are gonna think I'm so cool once I tell them I drank Prime! I'm coming! <laughs> oh man, I can't wait to try this Prime! I'm pretty upset they didn't have bottles, but a can is just as good! Okay, here I go! So how's your Prime taste, Logan Paul? It's really good! It's like the best drink ever! It's just a little sour at first! What are you doing now, Billy? Well, ever since I started drinking Prime, my brain power has been at like 100%. So I started collecting Pokemon cards. These are going to be my investment. They're going to be worth a trillion dollars when I'm older. <laughs> oh my god, that's your average Prime drinker for you. Hey everybody, it's Billy here. And I just wanted to let you all know, today I drank my very first Prime. Now what are you doing? Are you serious right now? I'm trying to vlog and you just messed it up. Now I gotta start over. Hi, everybody! Alright, calm down, Billy Paul. I was just asking you a question. Hey, guys! Guys, watch this! I'm literally gonna do the gritty with my Prime! <laughs> I should've just took the punishment instead of taking him to the store. Well, now you know for next time. Billy, what are you doing on top of the couch? I'm Logan Paul from WWE, and this is gonna be my finisher from the top ropes! <laughs> Hey guys, hey guys, listen to this new song I learned. One, two, buckle my shoe. Three, four, buckle some more. Five, six, Nike kicks. Oh my god, he's never gonna stop. Billy, you don't even wear Nike shoes. You wear light up Skechers. So what? You don't need Nikes to sing that song. Plus, everybody thinks I have the coolest shoes at school. Do people actually tell you that, Billy? No, but when I walk down the hallway, everybody's laughing because my shoes are lighting up and it's like a school rave. Brr, brr, brr. It's a good time. They're not laughing with you, Billy. They're laughing at you. You're right. You guys are just jealous on the life of the party. Hey, guys, I got a question. How many fingers am I holding up? One. <laughs> Two. Buckle my shoe. Three. Four. Buckle some more. Five. Six. Nike kicks. I swear, he has to be adopted. There's no way he's related to us. I agree. I'm going to play Fortnite so I can get away from this. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, I won! Two, buckle my shoe! Three, four, buckle some more! Five, six, Nike kicks! Are you serious? I said I won, not the number one. homework. What's three minus two? No, mom, don't answer! Tommy, what's the big deal? Your brother needs help with his math homework. The answer is one. <laughs> two, buckle my shoe! Three, four, buckle some more! Five, six, Nike kicks! Oh my goodness, what a cute little song! Look at my little Justin Bieber. I want to sing it too! One, two, buckle my shoe! Three, four, buckle some more! Oh my god. Michael, Michael, I got a question. What show is he from? Dude, that's Captain Luffy. He's from one. <laughs> Two, buckle my shoe! Three, four, five, six, Nike kick right to the face! Oh, <laughs> hey mom, happy Mother's Day. Here you go. Oh well, thank you. $20. I'm gonna spend this at Target. You're welcome, Mom. Actually, you know what? I'm going out later and I'm going to need some gas money. Can I borrow 10 bucks? Just take the 20 back. Hey, Mom. Happy Mother's Day. I got you the camera that you really wanted. Oh, thanks. They came out with a new model. I don't want this anymore. Are you serious? I had to save up five paychecks to buy that. Well, then you should have saved up six paychecks and got me the newer one. Whatever. Can't wait till you get old and I can put you in a home. Hey, Mom. Happy Mother's Day. I made you this picture. Oh my goodness, this is the nicest gift I ever got. You know what? This is going on the fridge. Perfect. <laughs> I'm mom's favorite. Hey mom, what are we having for dinner? Oh, we're going to have meatloaf for dinner. Oh man, are you serious? Okay, mom. Michael, guess what? We're having meatloaf again for dinner. That's like three days in a row, and mom's meatloaf is always so dry. I can't eat meatloaf again. I'm going to go talk to mom and see if we can have pizza instead. Good luck. Hey, Mom, I was wondering if we could have pizza for dinner tonight. No, we can't have pizza. We're having meatloaf. You boys love my meatloaf. 
Yeah, but we've had it for like three days in a row, Mom. I think we should change it up and have some pizza today. No, we're having meatloaf. More like dry loaf. Excuse me, what'd you just say? I said, yay, meatloaf. All right, see you, Mom. So, how'd it go? Are we having pizza for dinner? No, and I'm lucky I didn't get a wooden spoon across the back of the head. It looks like we're having meatloaf again. You know what? Let me go ask. Hey, Mom, I just saw on the TV that Domino's is having a special. Buy two pizzas, get one free. Can we have pizza tonight? No, we can't have pizza. And guess what? Your mom's having a special tonight, too. Her special meatloaf. That's what we're eating. Aw, oh, man. Sorry, Michael. It didn't work. Looks like we gotta eat it. We're all out of options. La, 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 la. Hey, guys. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? I'm definitely thinking what you're thinking. So, Billy, are you excited about dinner tonight? We're having Mom's stinky dry meatloaf again. Ew, are you serious? How many times do we have to eat that? We're probably going to have to eat it for the rest of our lives, Billy. Unless you want to help us. Yeah, how would you like to eat pizza tonight? Pizza? I love pizza! Okay, listen up. I'll give you this dollar if you go ask Mom if we can have pizza for dinner tonight. Whoa! You'll give me a whole dollar just to ask Mom if we can have pizza? Okay, give me it! Ma! Nice touch with giving him a dollar. I really hope this works. It should. Mom can't say no to Billy. Hey, Mom! Hey, Mom! Can we have pizza for dinner tonight, please? But I'm making my meatloaf. You love my meatloaf. Yeah, but I love pizza more. Please, Mom, can we have pizza? Pretty please, pretty please. Oh, my little sweetie. I can't say no to that face. Fine, we can have pizza. I'll order it now. Thanks, Mom. You're the best. My brothers are such suckers. I got a dollar, and I'm having pizza for dinner. Hey, guys! Guys! What happened? Are we having pizza or not? Yup, we're having pizza. Mom's ordering it now. Yes! I can't believe I'm about to say this, but good job, Billy. Oh, nice. We got one fruit by the foot left. Tommy, Tommy, have you seen my... <gasps> what are you eating? What's it look like I'm eating? I'm eating fruit by the foot. But those are mine! Mom bought them for me because they're my favorite snack! Calm down, Ice Spice. I didn't see your name on it. I like Fruit by the Foot, too. Mom told you to stop calling me that! And you better hope there's more! <laughs> Are you serious? He ate the last one?! Oh my god, what do you want now? Care to explain? The box is empty! You ate the last one! I can't believe you would do that! <laughs> Ouch, are you serious, Billy? Yeah, I'm serious. I was looking forward to eating that. You know what? I'm finally going to stand up for myself. <laughs> stay back. I'm warning you. I said stay back. Ouch, you hit me in the eye. I like fruit by the foot too, Billy. Uh-oh. Ouch. Tommy, stop. Stop hitting me with fruit by the foot. Now get out of here. I'm trying to watch TV. Okay, okay, whatever. I'm telling Mom. Mom. Tommy, I can't believe you ate your brother's last fruit by the foot. And then you used it to beat him up? I didn't know they were his, Mom. Plus, he threw the box at me. I had to do something. I'm sure what he did was an accident. He didn't mean to throw the box at you. Now get up to your room. You're grounded. Are you kidding me? Fine, whatever. At least I still got my fruit by the foot.